Basketball, often called b-ball, is a custom game mode in Team Fortress 2. This game mode exists in two forms, as a standalone game mode and as part of MGE, or My Gaming Edge. In the former it's played on custom capture the flag maps, in the latter it's played on MGE training maps. This mod game mode dates back to sometime in early 2009. At the time of recording this there are approximately 15 servers running the standalone version and roughly 120 servers running it within MGE. This video pertains to the standalone version of basketball over the MGE version, but both share characteristics. So what is basketball? Basketball is a custom game mode where two teams of soldiers utilize explosive jumping and combat in order to capture a flag in their opponent's basketball hoop. A round of basketball starts with every player spawning in at the far ends of a basketball court behind the posts with a neutral intelligence flag in the center of the map. Players must fight over control of the flag and have to explosive jump while holding the flag onto their opponent's basketball hoop in order to score points. When one team successfully gets a point, players instantly reset back to spawn positions and respawn with full health and ammo. The flag respawns on the basketball court's free throw line on the side of the court that just got scored on. A round ends when one team reaches a certain amount of points, usually 25. If neither team reaches the number of points needed when the timer runs out, the team with the most points wins the round. Timers are usually set to 20 minutes. In terms of the specific details, basketball differs slightly from server to server and map to map. These are some general characteristics of the game mode. It's usually played 2 players versus 2 players, but can be played 1 on 1 or 3 on 3. The main area of maps resemble a basketball court. These courts share the same dimensions, making the play experience consistent to a degree between maps. The courts are roughly 20% larger than real world standard basketball NBA and FIBA courts. Servers limit players from playing classes other than the soldier, however, some may allow the use of the demo man. The use of most weapons that aren't stock weapons or reskins of stock weapons are banned or discouraged. Tournament mode is enabled on basketball servers. This means both teams have to ready up before a round can begin, and the HUD indicates the health of teammates when spectating. Death cams and respawn waves are disabled. In addition, players respawn quicker than usual. In competitive play, historically North American leagues have used 2 second respawn times, while European leagues have opted for 6 seconds. Basketball maps are designed in a certain way with nuanced details to simulate some aspects of the real world sport. Here are some small things to take note of, as well as some general information that isn't obvious. At the start of a round when the flag is in the center of the map, it can only be picked up by rocket jumping or with a well timed crouch jump. This is to simulate the very start of a real life basketball game where players jump for the ball. When the flag responds on the free throw lines, it's also in the air, but only requires a regular jump to reach. Rockets pass right through the basketball post's rim and get nullified by the backboard. Despite the ground and fences looking uneven and warped, they're actually flat and solid in order to promote the use of rocket jumps. Basketball is a mod game mode with relations to competitive play and competitive training. The game mode is used to practice rocket jumping, air strafing, and shooting opponents in the air. It isn't very common, but in the past there have been basketball tournaments, similar to tournaments for regular competitive play in Team Fortress 2. And that's basically basketball in a nutshell. A competitive training custom game mode loosely based off a of real world sport. Basketball with guns and rocket launchers. Thanks for watching! Like if you enjoyed or learned something new and subscribe for more videos like this one. Au revoir!